Both candidates for U.S. Senator Republican Mehmet Oz and Democrat John Fetterman campaigned here in the Pittsburgh area today. As political editor John Delano reports, it comes as both candidates come out swinging with more attacks. Some polls show a tightening race between Lieutenant Governor John Fetterman and celebrity doctor Mehmet Oz. On Tuesday, they each campaigned in a region that is must win for both. Campaigning in Zelianopol Tuesday morning, Mehmet Oz toured a maker of industrial commercial fans and attacked John Fetterman for a radical left agenda. The left radical side of the American political spectrum firmly believes we need more government, Folks like me, who represent most of the rest of the country, believe in American individualism, exceptionalism, and trust our country and our American people. Oz criticized Fetterman on crime and open borders that he said was allowing drug cartels to bring fentanyl to Pennsylvania. I believe we can have safe city streets. My opponent, John Fetterman, wants to release one third of all prisoners. I want a secure border, and then I want to allow legal immigration, like my father would experience. Bring people in that we want to bring in. Do I get it right? And he accused Fetterman of not campaigning as he recovers from his stroke. My opponent's not going anywhere. John Fetterman has only done one campaign event in three and a half months. Fetterman denies that, noting many Zoom appearances while recovering. And now he says he's campaigning in person, like a rally at Steelworkers headquarters in Pittsburgh late Tuesday. With Steelworkers, you were the very first endorsement my campaign ever got in this race. Fetterman went right after Oz, noting Oz's 10 homes while citing his own home in Braddock across from a steel mill. I live in the shadow of the Edgar Thompson plant. You know, let me ask you a question. Of the 10 homes Dr. Oz has, do you think any of them have a steel plant across any of them? I do. And Fetterman made fun of Oz's reference to a veggie tray as crudite. Dr. Oz, crudite comes to his mind. It's not steel workers. But you know what comes to my mind also is making sure that I'm going to be proud to stand and defend the union way of life. With the election just 11 weeks away, both candidates so far have seemed to ignore the attacks of the other. But this campaign is only beginning to heat up. John Delano. KDKA News.